Good evening, greetings from Hydro Motorcycle Sales, Eaton, Ohio. So, if you're watching at home, you may want to shield your eyes. If you don't like seeing things that are bare, you're about ready to see something that's very bare. But rest assured, we're going to fix that problem very soon. We just thought we'd take note that, uh, yeah, the showroom only has three Euro motorcycles left in it, one of which is a pre-owned. That's right, for the first time in history, we've sold all the way down to two units. Have two 2021s sitting here. Twenty twenty one. Euro gear up in the satin burgundy metallic. And this does have the silver engine. This unit is available. And then you saw the retro. You've seen our video on this one. A gentleman from Iowa. Good customer Joe. He rode in and traded for a brand new 2021 CT. In the same color nonetheless. Always appreciate the repeat business. And then this afternoon, we did have two. Now we only have one. What's that fly doing there? This is the 2021 Sahara. A good customer from the local area. He's going to be trading his 2017 Euro gear up in on this 2021 Sahara. So we'll be swapping some parts over from his bike and putting on this unit. And he'll be off and riding on a brand new 2021. And next week we do have some more inventory coming in. Uh, on Monday the truck should arrive with three 2021 CTs that are going to be available. Uh, two standard configuration, one in slate gray, the other in olive drab. Both of those will have the silver powertrain. And then we'll have a black and silver two-tone CT. That'll be coming in. It'll have the silver wheels and the stainless steel grab rails and all that good stuff. So those three are available and they'll be here on Monday. So we'll get them assembled as soon as we can next week. And those will be on the floor. And like I say, do have the trade-ins coming in on this uh, 2021 Sahara, which is a 2017 it's a, uh, I believe it's an asphalt gray gear up. It may be a slate gray. No, it's an asphalt gray gear up. Uh, so that one will be available. And in here pretty soon, we will have a 2020 Sahara that will be pre-owned. That has, I think it's going to have about 6,000 miles on it. Um, it will be available soon on the pre-owned. And then what everybody's been waiting for, the 2022s. First shipment hits stateside the end of September, uh, so about 10 days after that we will see them. Uh, so we'll be seeing some of those around the 10th to the 15th of uh, October, and we'll be getting those assembled. Do have uh, several of them on left on the first shipment that are available. I do have some of them sold. I think I've taken, oh, I don't know, several deposits so far on uh, bikes that are coming in during October. So do have a couple custom orders as well. And then we've ordered some more 2022 CT models. Uh, so we'll have those coming in. CT is still available in 2022. Uh, there are a couple other changes that nobody said anything about. Uh, CTs for 2022 will not have a sidecar windscreen. That's correct. Uh, $16,999 is the base price for 2022 CT in standard color with silver engine. And it will not have the sidecar windscreen. Uh, then 21, they come standard with a short sidecar windscreen. Uh, but in 22, we've been told there will not be a sidecar windscreen as standard. Still available as an accessory, but uh, it's additional $349.95. Uh, so that's going to make a standard configuration uh, for, for pricing purposes uh, with the increase in the inbound destination and the increase in the setup charge. Uh, apples to apples comparison. 2021 CT in standard configuration can be had for $16,739 out the door. 
and plus tax if applicable out the door and then in 2022 a standard configuration ct adding the sidecar windscreen to make it an apples to apples comparison in a standard color uh you're looking at uh be what let's see add it up here in my head real quick uh do do do, do looks like 1938.95 so essentially nineteen thousand dollars uh versus sixteen seven thirty nine so rounded up to seventeen thousand uh so you're looking at two thousand dollars difference there so if you're in the market for a single wheel drive ct uh don't hesitate i do have the three 2021s uh, that are left available uh two of which are standard configuration that would be your 16739 plus tax if applicable out the door and then the other one is a black and silver two-tone which is a color they used on the patrol many years ago it is available of course it's a custom color so it's a two-tone that's 1500 additional and then it does have the silver kit which is another 1500 so there's three grand added on to it uh, so you're looking at for ballpark round numbers it's going to stick her around 20 um, but still it's going to be about two thousand dollars cheaper than what the 2022s are going to be so should you wait for a 22 or should you just buy a 21 uh that's a personal choice, but uh, I'd go ahead and buy the 21 and be riding. Um, but uh, if you want the latest and greatest, we do have the 2022s coming, and you can be one of the first on the list. Like I say, I've already taken several deposits, so give us a call, send us an email, let us know what you're looking for. And keep in mind, too, there's some other changes that uh, go over here in the, uh, the shop. I haven't cleaned the shop here in a little bit, so it could be a little bit of a mess. Uh, but parts-wise, we keep parts and accessories in stock. And up here on the top shelf, you'll see the assembly of different colored, color-matched factory fairings. Uh, for 2022, that goes away, so there will be no color-matched factory there will not be a color matched factory fairing available only in primer gray uh, so if you're in the market for a fairing there's 2015 style terracotta uh, that was the terracotta prior to going to the metallic garden green that's your old patrol green also called woodland green od 182 that's still used that's the color of the ct that's coming in um, satin burgundy metallic that's just like the unit setting out there on the floor terracotta satin that's that code two it's in two hundreds uh, it is the satin terracotta that they came out with on the adventure kit that's the gloss silver uh, you guys remember Ron the high mileage rider uh, that's a silver fairing um, that's the same color as Ron's bike of course you see on the top that's the slate gray that is the color of the CT that's coming in that I mentioned couple of GVs or Givy, however you want to say it. Uh, blue and white, yep, that's the blue and white two-tone. Um, we did a video a couple weeks ago, I think, on the low mileage uh, 2011 patrol that the gentleman had purchased with like 50 kilometers on it, maybe 49 kilometers, something like that. Uh, that's the same blue and white color there. And the burgundy metallic, again, that, bur that burgundy metallic, that's actually the gloss burgundy metallic. We had a video up here a while back on a pre-owned 2017 that we purchased. That's what that burgundy metallic is. We have a black, that's the gloss black, just like the, what the black is on the retro. Primer gray, yep, primer gray will still be available, and I do have at least one of those. There might be two in that box. Forest fog fairing, forest fog being the unit that 2015 that we just sold here last week. Uh, that you guys may have seen the video on that's the color for that one and then we found that northwest gray uh, northwest gray is the color that the you see have seen the red sparrow advertised uh, that's northwest gray and of course dark forest fog what's dark forest fog there were actually multiple forest fog colors uh, there's a lighter color which is almost like a gray and then there was the one that looked almost black and terracotta metallic that's a 173 which is terracotta metallic um, oh yeah 
if you guys get on Ural's website and they have something listed that they're showing sold out, just because they say it's sold out, that just means they don't have it in inventory. Um, as a dealer, we've dealt with that for years. It's commonplace that we place orders with the parts house and that's out of inventory. Uh, it's just the way it's always been. But that doesn't mean that a dealer doesn't have it. Right there, you see we've got five, yes, five times smoke touring adventure or smoke touring adjustable windscreen is what that's supposed to say um, so that's the one that Ural currently shows out of stock we've got some of those um, got uh, I think I've got more over here I think I've got them in clear uh, got the regular Ural windscreen that's the non-adjustable one there's three clear two smoke um, and then we have two times the adjustable touring which should just be the clear green jerry canisters um, some of the nitron shocks got several sets of those um, black ammo box storage box got those uh, what else were they listing is out of stock i think they were out on their receiver tube right there you see 52340 part number reading that upside down ural inch and a quarter um, accessory receiver got at least one of those uh, gpr exhaust got some of those so as you can see we've got all kinds of good stuff uh the other note as you may hear the phone ringing in the background, keep in mind we are on Eastern time. So if you're out on the West Coast and you call us at say three o'clock your time, that's gonna be six o'clock our time. We're not gonna be here, or at least we're probably not answering the phone. So don't get all upset and wonder why we're closed. That's the dark forest fog. Looks like it was code 122. Um, what else we got down here? Uh, that's the satin burgundy, got another one of those. There's a gloss white. Sidecar windscreens got those, plenty of those extra um, glazing plastics, plenty of oil filters. I think I've got, uh, I don't know, there's, well, those are just part of them. I think right now inventory is showing about 200 of the MGO inserts, and there's about 300 of the high flow filters. Uh, I got those on hand. Clutch plates, all that good stuff. So we try to stock a large inventory of parts. Uh, no, we don't rely on the drop ship system. Uh, the air compressor just kicked on, sorry about that. Um, but no, we don't try to uh, just wait till a customer orders and then have it drop shipped. We've always been of the uh, philosophy that it should be on our shelf. Um, if you guys need it, we've probably got it. Yeah, you may get on our website and say, yeah, it's a little outdated, not everything's listed. Uh, well, we try to, concentrate on customer service person-to-person -person contact um, we'll make sure we get you the right parts the first time around so so if you're in the area stop in to see us 4440 Quaker Trace Road Eaton Ohio send us an email sales that's s-a-l-e-s -E at hangleengineering.com Of course, our website, heindelengineering.com. Telephone number, area code 937-787-3686. We're located on the southern edge of Wheatville, which as you can see here, reading the map, it's nine miles between Gratis and Eaton. We are located right about here, approximately two and a half miles outside of Gratis. Quaker Trace Road goes like this. It goes out of Glenwood and goes straight down. Wheatville is right there. So it gives you an idea where we're located. The good old county of Preble. That is Preble County. Um, lots of different interesting sites to see. If you guys are in the area and you like staying in the state parks, um, Houston Woods State Park, it sits on the border of Preble County and Butler County, just outside of Oxford. Oxford is where Miami University, Ohio is located, uh, in case you guys didn't know that. Uh, there's a little bit there of the airport. Um, there's Richmond Municipal Airport. Where is that located? Uh, there's actually a small town right here that's called Boston, Indiana. Um, on the southern edge here of Richmond and the airport is right in there. Um, do have the Richmond Municipal Airport. And as you can see, Ohio's a big state. But that's where we're located. A few used bikes, trade-ins. All three of those, uh, they were all traded in the last few weeks. 
more accessories, seats and whatnot. Always keep the Motul oils in stock as well. And then of course the Heitnow K37 tires. I uh, should mention that for 2022, uh, those are gonna be standard. The Heitnow tires will be standard in 2022. So not only your CT having your K28 400 by 18, your gear up will come standard with your Heidnow K37. And I guess I should mention, it's getting to be that time of year where Ural will probably release a limited edition for 2022. If I was going to bet, I probably already know what color that is because I saw one appear in the system that I tried to get a hold of and they told me I couldn't have that color yet. So I'm sure there's one in existence. No, I'm not going to spoil it for you. Uh, there's a description of the way that this was supposed to be painted from the factory. Uh, I have that listing and we may eventually put that up. Um, and then we'll see who can figure out what the paint's actually going to look like. But it should be pretty interesting. And as always, Euro kind of keeps that stuff uh, pretty secretive until we get very close to the release date. So, again, thought you guys like to see how bare the showroom is on Euro motorcycles. As always, we appreciate you watching. Heindel Motorcycle Sales, Heaton, Ohio. Thanks for watching.